A child in our area has faced incredible obstacles but keeps on going. I spoke with him about his lifelong bone disease and how he's trying to help others. It's this edition of Covenant Children's Stories of Strength. One day I'll be able to walk and five seconds later I'll be on the ground. That's a daily concern for 11 year old Caleb Gilbert. When Caleb was born, we noticed that he had a little bit of ribs, some little bumps on his ribs. We took him to the pediatrician. She said, well, maybe it's just some cartilage issues. We'll just watch it and see what happens. And so we kind of just left that alone until he was about two. That's when doctors diagnosed him with a rare bone disease. Multiple hereditary exostosis. He has little bumps, which are actually abnormally forming new bone on most of the uh, bones. And sometimes they're little projections that look like a, a, like a stalactite or a stalagmite. Other times it just distorts the bone and it grows, you know, bigger around. Caleb had two serious operations because of his condition. Fourth grade. We had to have extensive surgery on his arm, so Dr. Gutal actually went in and flipped, cut his bone off, flipped it over, plated it back together. He actually still has those plates in there now. Even with a cast on his riding hand for the start of the school year, Caleb's determination for success was still there. Just learned to write with my right hand and I was good with that. And then this April we went in and had to have his ankle fused together. I'm a very independent person. Being in a wheelchair was definitely the hardest so far since everybody had to push me around and everything. These setbacks have made Caleb stronger. It's so hard to watch him go through the pain and the surgery, but it's also amazing to watch him overcome and to to come out of it almost better than what he went in. He's had this amazing compassion and he really, really wants to help people and make them aware of what MHE is. That gave Caleb the idea to host a fun walk in 5K, another leap of faith, hoping to raise awareness and money for a cure. The walks named Warriors for MHE after my favorite Bible verse, put on the full armor of God. I think God gave us this idea, not just our friends. Faith has been the reoccurring focus of Caleb's medical journey. If we haven't had God on our side, then everything would have probably been a lot more painful. I can see him changing other people's lives because he has all these pain issues. He has all these things, restrictions on his life, and he never lets that slow him down. He takes those in stride. He tries to do better, and he tries to help other people. So our faith has grown amazingly because of him and his faith. Caleb thanks God for giving him the best doctor at Covenant Children's, making those numerous hospital visits not so bad. Dr. Gutile, he's definitely the best doctor here because of the fact that he just knows what the kids are like and he's able to take care of them. It's a bummer having to come to the orthopedic surgeon over and over. But, you know, we try to make it as fun as we can. We have a lot of fun, especially with our, we call them the frequent flyers. It's been a comfort to know that you have somewhere that you can go that you know he's going to be taken care of. All of the money raised at his fun walk will go to research for finding a cure for MHE. But since Caleb already has the disease. I doubt that this, will, this cure will really benefit me. So I'm just doing it for everyone else with this disease. Another example of the 11 year old selflessness. Caleb's Warriors for MHE run is October 14th at McKenzie Park. For more information, open the Fox 34 News app. I'm Tierra Newbaum with Fox 34, your health.